This is Olana. And I'm Isaac. We're, we're moving, moving to, to Hawaii. Hawaii! But first... We're driving from New York City to Seattle. With Smiley, our nine-year-old rescue pity. In our Tesla Model 3, equipped for camping. And we are funding this trip with our Etsy store. Meaning we are bringing around 50,000 earrings. And 500 envelopes. And our label printer. On this 11-day cross-country road trip. Subscribe to the Travel Bug Bite today! So this is our fancy part of this roof bag. And so quick recap that um, that mattress is uh, $295 if you want the, the really thick one. I think the one that's three inches thinner is uh, less expensive, which I would have actually preferred. I know the comfort level is great, but I don't see how we're going to fit that on this road trip. Uh, but Thank you. we bought this roof bag. This was $123 on Amazon, and it goes on the top of the car without the need of a roof rack, and you just strap it through the windows. And Explain our uh, logic behind doing this. Yeah, so we're shipping our car once we get to Seattle. We're shipping it to Maui, uh, and if we had a roof rack, we would have to take the box. Like, you're not allowed to have the roof box. So And it's too big to ship yeah, so um, this thing and with USPS, need, so. Exactly. This thing doesn't even need, uh, what's it called? A, you know what? Actually, it's... Oh, the, 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 the cargo top is, yeah, the cargo top is too big to ship. But, so yeah, this thing comes with this top thing so it doesn't ruin your car. How effective it is at preventing damage is a question. Uh, well, you should remind people that the top of a Tesla is all glass. Yeah, so... And it's like the kind of glass that's meant to be safe if it breaks, so it's easy to break. And it'll shatter on top of us, raining glass, if it breaks. Okay. All right, open her up. Uh, how do I do that? <laughs> what did we just do? So we thought that it only opened like this tiny bit at the end, but yeah, it, it goes all the way around this roof bag. So let's see. We're not all the way around, I don't see think. see how far, let's see how wide you can open it. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're, we're children. Oh, I think it's only um, half. Yeah, you can go. No, you can go all the oh, way. Oh, the other way too. Yeah, that's great. So this kind of turns inside out. So my thing is we could fit so much stuff in here if we didn't have to shovel mattresses. But we don't need to bring it. so much stuff. My thing is that all we need to bring is sleeping stuff and a few clothes. And, well, and, and the earrings, but... And the dog in the crate. Oh, the and dog in the... And all the dog supplies and all the... Yeah. Oh, yeah, whatever. I'm the optimist in this relationship. Right, let's see. I don't even know if this would make sense as the place to put this, but... I think it does make sense. Because then we can access everything else during the day easily. So that would mean that if this fits, all told, this entire thing, like, with this is like $500 just to be able to sleep where we could have just stayed at hotels. But we didn't want to stay at hotels. So we wanted camping to be part of the adventure, and we can use this during the move, because we're not always going to have a mattress, so you know what? Actually, I think this is going to fit quite nicely. It is, and, and we can fit a blanket. And everything can fit inside of it as well. Do you want to mention what kind of blankets we use? Um, we use weighted blankets that are super heavy, so... Oh, there goes something. So we're going to be using very heavy blankets to put on the top of the car. Oh, wow, yeah, this fits perfectly. The guy for my Tesla would do well to point out that this works. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if he like wanted to jump on it and and also loud car and also <laughs> it's not heavy so if you put the heavier stuff on top that might affect your range on the car a lot more I don't um, think that's a thing I think heavier lower is better also based on the Tesla group I'm in they really said that weight does not make a huge difference weight doesn't make a huge difference aerodynamic does yes yeah, so if it's heavy on top doesn't make a difference if it yes uh, if it's light on top stuff. well that's where the it's things stressed. are yeah. so Put this on top. That's gonna be fun to lift with uh, weighted blankets. And then there are two straps. I think I put the other There's one in the one there and one here. No. What's this? That's different. Oh. So. Basically, you string it through these little loops up here. We've already tried driving with it in the rain, and uh, we found out that it doesn't rain into the windows. Yep. It does so, keep it nice and I don't know where closed. the other strap is. I think I put it through the wash or something, so I won't be able to actually show this right now. 
I love how they have their name on it. It's like an advertisement for their company. Hey, look at me, I'm a roof rack. The roof, roof rack bag. bag, whoops. I can't put down the windows. Don't know why, anyway. So like, even though the Tesla oh, wanna windows show it again? have no frames, Okay, I want to. Oh, careful, but I wanna show it again? Uh, opening, cause you know, the windows, I was worried about this. Yeah, I was it very against... somehow closes hard enough that it, it doesn't, you can't even yeah. move it if you try. You go over here. That's not straight, but we're not okay, driving we're now, not, so. We're not actually driving it right now, I'm just showing. And then this clips here. And then just make sure the clip, clippy part doesn't go in the window. Yeah, so you do that as tight as you can. You do the other one through the front windows. Um, let's see. Oh, I have another question. You can see what it looks inside. How, you know, it has to stretch. I have a the, question. What's the question? Will it be okay to drive with the windows open a little bit? Or will it move more? It would probably, I think the windows help it stay secure better. And like but these you, scratches, is that from this? Enough. No, that's from whatever the road. Yeah, our car stuff. needs to be completely fixed up. We have still some key marks from some nice people in Brooklyn. And it's gonna be. And some little fun. dents from nice people in uh, Rhode Island. You mean like me? Well, no, that oh, one, yeah, that that one was, was, at, um, that was at, yeah, I remember that. We were jumping off a bridge and someone's like, I'm gonna crash into your car. Yep, and then they denied it. I have a, I have a photo of the license plate and everything. I just never got around to hmm. doing something about it. Yeah, and well. this is theoretically waterproof, so we won't have to be sleeping on a wet mattress. <sighs> Hopefully. Yeah. Oh, yeah, so I think for that, you just need to make sure to put it the right way up. Isaac. Put it the right way up because oh, yeah. the flap goes over the zipper and that's where the water would go in if it was yep, going to go in. But the strap I also have upside down because you should have it so that you can pull it downward to tighten oh. it. So, yeah. you know, you should be able to do this. But anyway, this was just a trial, so. So all these things together, what that was uh, included in the price, the sheet for it? Uh, yes. Cool. The sheet, yeah, oh yeah, I didn't put the sheet on, but. That's fine. They, they have them in like seven different colors. We got the burgundy ones. Really Very nice, cool. like cotton. They're not things. nice. I, I checked, and you could have gotten these oh. in like a much higher thread count. That's what I'm saying. Is Isaac is not a have, fan of thread counts. Maybe we should have gone third party on this, but who knows? I don't know. But well, no. The thing about other uh, mattresses, though, is that they don't fold up. Yeah. So if you're uh, if you're interested in seeing if this actually worked, subscribe. You'll be you'll be uh pleasantly entertained we'll show you all the bloopers all the successes all the tears of us being like stop kicking me or sleep outside i think we we'll totally sleep outside though right 